going on, man? It's your boy Sincere, and you are here at the BX Boys Broadcasting and Recording Studio. And you know we rocking with the king indeed. Get your life right. Oh, yes, indeed. Yes, indeed. Yes, indeed. I'm that kid, K.I. Zoraldo, the gray-haired bandit of the king indeed. And we are here. We are here. We are here. Once again, I'm here rocking with my brother. Sincere, the real sincere can't be duplicated. Where are we, sir? Let us know right now. Yes, indeed. We're here <laughs> in the home of them BX boys, recording and broadcast studios located in the Bronx. DM us or hit us up at music at them bxboys.com. That's music at them bxboys.com. Get your life right. Now, how, how long you had the studio? Uh, I'm going to say we had the studio already for a couple of years, but now mm -hmm. we're, we're just opening up to the general public. Okay. You know what I mean? So um, we're, we're just ready to rock and roll, man. So if people need a home to record at, need a place to hang out, right. you know what I mean? We're going to open the doors to the community, to the youth, teach them, get them involved with music, teach them about radio, broadcasting, and all of that stuff. So, yeah. We're, we're, we're in the Bronx right now, BX. Uh, why was it so important for you to get a studio here. You could have a studio anywhere, but it seems like you always stay grounded with the BX. I know we're DM, them BX boys, them Bronx boys. I know that's exactly what you represent. Them Bronx boys, pardon me, I see you got the uh, iced out uh, uh, Jesus there. I ain't mad at you. Um, what's what's the importance of only being in the Bronx? Tell me, please. Well, being that I'm, you know I mean, from the Bronx, you know I mean, mm -hmm. and, and and all of that stuff. I want it to be easy for some kid to, to have the same aspirations as I did to, to say, I want to do this music right. and have the same local reach that I did. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Because nowadays it's a little easier. So, you know, I, I just want it to be where a little, you know, a little boy, a little girl want to jump on a six train, get to, to our location and, and be like, all right, cool. I'm here. I'm home. I'm, you know, a tr couple of train stops away and make it easier for them to, like, achieve their goals and work towards their goals, copy, I should say. Copy. Yeah. Uh, studios is very competitive. Um, people have studios in their home. People have studios on their phones, on their planes, whatever. Um, why this studio? Uh, there's different studios in the Bronx. Uh, why this studio and why you sincere? Please. Well, again, you know, growing up in Bronx River Projects and, and seeing the culture, you know I mean, I'm an 80s baby. Yeah, I mean, I was born in 81, so here it is. I, I'm in Bronx Hill Projects growing up, looking right out my window on the first floor and, mm -hmm. and being able to see the basketball court, seeing the center and all of that stuff, Africa, Bambada, Zulu Nation, everybody running around doing their thing. And you see the break dances and all that in the community centers and all. And it, it was just something that I fell in love with. So if I fell in love with the culture. How many other kids out there that have the same love and the same, you know, the same affection towards the culture? The passion. As well? The passion, exactly. You mean? But your studio isn't just a studio where you're going to record music, correct? It's, it's a broadcast studio. Break it down for human beings out there that, that never been in a broadcast studio. You do different live shows. Please break it down to us. Well, this is a broadcasting and recording studio, right? Uh -huh. So... We have the recording side, uh -huh. and we also have the broadcasting. So mm -hmm. if somebody want to come in here and say, look, I want to be on radio, mm -hmm. we can make that happen. Mm -hmm. Also, we have the equipment. I mean, we have up-to-date equipment where people can come and do a podcast. They can do radio, whatever it is they, they want to oh, do. Oh, really? They can do a podcast and have a little radio show here as well? Absolutely. Absolutely. We set this up so we can have multiple entities running at the same time. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? So it's just another piece on the machine to make this whole thing happen and, you know, have them Bronx boys on that top of the food chain. The Bronx boys. Uh, them Bronx boys. Uh, how'd that concept come? Actually, them Bronx boys, that was a name that um, Swiss's father gave us. You know what I mean? Um, them Bronx boys. Swiss who? Swiss Beats. Okay. His father, TD. Shout out to TD, man. Um, mm -hmm. He gave us that. You know what I mean? Um, so, so running around with Rough Riders and all of that, and he was like, yo, you know, that's them Bronx boys right there. So it was just like <laughs> something dope. that stuck with me. I was like, all right, I'm, I'm going to take that and run with it, TD. He was like, yo, go ahead, beloved. You know what I <laughs> mean? Um, so definitely shout out to TD, man. Salute, TD. You know what I mean? And, and it just stood with us ever since. All right, I hear He's still you. still with me. Uh, I know that uh, there's a human being that you talk about all the time that, unfortunately, I've, I was not able to meet yet. Oh, 
Yes. Oppressed. I haven't met him yet, and I can't wait till I meet him to get him on it because he deserves his glory. He deserves his uh, interview and over. You listening to this? I'm sure you will be listening. To this. I got nothing but love for you. All right. Even though you never met me in the physical, you dig? You were still here because he makes sure he reminds me all the time. Uh, then Brown Boys ain't just me, man. We got Oppressed. We got a whole team. Always reminds me. So you are here. You are here. You are here. You are here. Um, I know you can't talk about pricing and all that, but. I'm just saying, are you, are you competitive? What I'm trying to say, or, or, you know, because you got to remember, son, you're, you're, you're affiliated with Rough Riders. You're the program director of Rough Rider Radio. Mm -hmm. um, that's serious. Um, is, 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 is the pricing competitive? Is it, you know what I'm trying to say to you? Do you get what you, you know, pay for? Like, talk to us a little bit about it. Well, you got you get what you pay for. Bang. Let's just put it that way. You, you know what I mean? Um, we on sale, but we're not, you know, we're for sale, but not on sale. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. At the end of the day, at the end of the day, we try to make this as much as is economically possible mm -hmm. for the average artist to come and record. Understood. You know what I'm saying? So we work with different types of budgets. We work with different types of okay. people as well. So, you know, at the end of the day, it's just like that little TikTok video that's going around. Which one? You, you know talking about? I don't have TikTok. What, what do you you mean? don't have TikTok? No, I don't. Oh, you got to get on there. Make sure you follow them BX boys on all social media <laughs> platforms, man. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, he ain't played. That's what it didn't be, ex boys. We are hip. What would you like to tell right now? Look into the camera right now. What would you like to tell all human beings, is up and coming artists, uh, up and coming journalists, up and coming uh, producers and, and programmers out there right now? What type of advice would you like to tell them? And why should we well, already said why should they be here? But what type of advice would you like to tell them right now? If this is what you want to do. Pursue it. You know what I mean, don't don't let nobody stop your your aspirations, your your beliefs, and your love, and, and let no one stop your passion. If this is what you want to do, if you want to be an artist, you want to be a journalist, you want to be someone on radio, radio personality, do what you got to do for yourself. Don't let nobody stop you. Don't say you know somebody you just one no. Don't let that be your last no. There'll be fifteen no's before you get that one yes and. Go to where you gotta go. Did you know that you you'd be doing radio? I know we talked about it before in the past, and I know that you know, I know your history. You guys started with my son. You started at DSN and all that. But did you know? Because it seems like you're an extremely humble person, but you're vicious at the same time. Um, I didn't know I was gonna be doing radio, but um, shout out to to the whole squad, the whole team. Of Bang. course, my son, Bang. you know, um, my brother, old pressure. Bang. I gotta shout out Jen. She, you know, she put this little monster in me, and then all, I started with New Bronx City, and we was doing that. And after that, it was just like, you know what? Um, I got the phone call from from Wa. Shout out to Wa. Um, shout out to the whole Dean family, giving us many many opportunities to be who we are yes. and be creative. He called me up. He's like, Yo, Sin, look, I got this studio. It's all yours. This is you. Wow. Do what you got to do with this radio. We let's bring it home and make it make sense. Bang. And ever since then, I just been here holding my position as Rough Rider Radio Board Director. Now I'm the CEO to them Bronx boys. Got my own location. So um, that that little thing is just, you never know until that seed is planted. Somebody wants to come in there uh, uh, to actually go ahead and um, actually purchase or lease your various services here. How can they do that? Please. All right, we're going to keep this very simple and very professional as well. Music at thembxboys.com. That's music at thembxboys.com. Or you can shoot us a text at 929 Four nine seven forty two sixty seven. That's nine two nine four nine seven forty two sixty seven. Shoot us a text or an email. There it is. We out of here. The great head bandit Zerallo, them BX boys. We are here. What's the name of the studio again? Them BX boys recording and broadcasting studio. Them BX boys recording and broadcast studio. Oh yes, indeed. We are here. Why y'all not here, huh? Gentlemen, ladies. Boys and girls, sober ones and drunk ones and high ones. We are out of here. We out of here? We out of here. Bang, bang, bang. Yes, indeed. Sincere for president. Oh, pressure, I see you. Yes, indeed. Bang. Oh, yeah. Yo, what's going on, man? It's your boy, Sincere, and I'm here with the King and D. Get your life right. Log on to the King We're not doing it yet. No, we ain't doing that. That's the drop. Hold on, that's the drop. We're doing at the end. 